What is up everybody, it is your bro J.O. coming to you guys yet yeah, with a new video. After today's video, we're going to be talking about my current rotation in regards to clothes. One of the reasons why I'm making this video is because as of recently, I checked one of my best videos was my current sneaker rotation. So I decided to kind of think outside the box and go with clothing just to see how it goes, to see how you guys like it, how you guys receive it, the feedback that I'll get from it. Um, it's something that is not um, involved in my channel, but definitely looking to try new things and this is one of them. Um, besides that, that's pretty much it. So let's get right into the video. The first piece that I find myself wearing a lot, especially during the spring and the winter time or just this time of the month, time of the year, which it is March, um, is this Levi's denim jacket. It's just a jacket that's very versatile, goes well with pretty much anything. And this color, this navy blue, is a color that I have been rocking with a lot lately. I've been actually going for like that Canadian tuxedo vibe, that double denim look, that just denim on denim. And it's something that I'm honestly a fan of. If you don't know me, you know that's something that I do love. Denim is just one of the best fabrics that man has ever made, one of the best fabrics that can just last all weather conditions and I just love denim to be honest especially Levi's it's honestly one of my favorite brands and if you've been following the channel you see that most of the pants and most of the jeans that I wear are strictly Levi's here, here and then I'll break I'll break the barrier but most of the time I know for a fact that it's Levi's and yeah this jacket is honestly very durable good quality and I ended up getting it for a steal surprisingly at Ross for like $40 and it's honestly one of the best investments that I've made I highly recommend it if you're looking for a top just to throw on in this time of the year during this weather and it's just something that's gonna last you for a while um, actually actually initially when I bought it it was a little darker but I have been washing it like crazy just because I do wash my denim I know some denim fanatics may think that's freaking crazy but yeah I do wash my denim and yeah that's just one of the pieces that I have been wearing as of lately the next piece I'll be showing you guys is this H&M sweater. It's honestly just a cool color, such a unique actual look, a unique color, and it's something that I've been wearing a lot lately due to the fact that I do live in California and the weather's a little strange out here. I'll be waking up at like 6.30 and it's freaking cold, but by the time it hits noon while I'm at school, it gets really hot. So it just gets really annoying and having a sweater that is honestly just you know you can zip up and just throw on and honestly just take off as well is something that allows me to function throughout the day very easily so i can be warm when i need it but also be comfortable and i guess more cool when i don't need it and that's just something that i do like i know a lot of people don't like sweaters with zippers on it but i honestly find them very functional especially for layering and especially when the weather is kind of strange and you don't know how it's going to end up being throughout the day um i highly recommend these sweaters at least having one in your closet is very essential i would honestly go with a color like this just um, due to the fact that it is a little more different or having like a neutral gray But yeah having a sweater like this is one that I need in my current rotation as of lately In regards to sweaters, I know we were just talking about the zipper one But this is another sweater that I've been wearing this one right here is from H&M as well It's just a beautiful color a beautiful statement piece. This one however is a pullover hoodie It doesn't have the zipper as you can tell it does have the pockets right here but this piece oof, has been with me in my closet for I want to say about two years now and I've been taking great care of it due to the fact that I do love this orange. I've never seen another hoodie like this in my life and I honestly I'm scared of wearing it but I do wear it a lot and that's the beautiful thing about this sweater it's held up really nicely especially being from H&M which I know is not the best quality out there but it gets the job done and honestly I've just been wearing it on usually Fridays when I'm pretty lazy to get ready for school I just want to go to my lecture and then go to my SI and simply just come back home and knock out and this is just a hoodie that I can throw on over pretty much any type of pants or shorts or pretty much any fit this thing is really essential it can be layered up dressed up um, layered down you know it's just a great piece and it's something that um, it has been one of my greatest investments to be honest and I've been wearing it a lot lately as I've told you before just on lazy days and yeah that's pretty much it 
The next piece I'll be showing you guys is honestly just a basic t-shirt. This one right here is from George, which I purchased at Walmart. And similar to the orange hoodie, it's just been a great investment in my opinion in regards to my style because I am into minimal fashion. And with minimal fashion, the colors you tend to wear with basic t-shirts are either white, gray, and black. And having some other alternative like a navy shirt does go a long way in regards to my style because it gives me more options to pretty much dress up my clothes a whole lot differently than I am used to. And just having something to pretty much play around with and just have a good time wearing it and trying new things. And this shirt and this color specifically, I highly recommend if you don't have a navy shirt to buy one. Um, it's very cheap and it's honestly very fun to just kind of throw on and see how it looks because initially, believe it or not, I actually hated this color, but I gave it a try due to the fact that it was kind of cheap and I ended up liking it so much that I've been wearing it a lot as of lately and especially now that the spring and summer are coming up, I see myself wearing this color even more. The next piece I've been wearing a lot is this polo shirt. This one again is from H&M. If you can't tell already, like H&M has been my go-to brand for like the longest, but now that I'm kind of making a little more money and kind of have my funds a little more set up better than I used to when I was younger, um, I'm trying to expand that. So if you guys have any other brands that you guys want me to check out, also link that um, down below and comment them down below so I can check them out for future videos and also, you know, future purchases because that's what I do like to do. You know, I'm a consumer at the end of the day like most of y'all and I just like to purchase wisely but anyways going back into the polo I've been wearing this one like crazy um, I've been wearing it a lot through this time of year due to the fact that I am kind of looking for an internship I'm just trying to impress people I guess you know I'm trying to look fresh I'm trying to look odd daddy out right now so I've been wearing you know polos especially with my loafers that I am wearing on right now for this video but it's just um, a business vibe and I am a business major if you don't know I'm an accounting major and just having this type of look on a days like where you just want to look good but don't want to overdo it having a polo definitely does that and it just goes good with the weather as I said before the weather here has been going from cold to hot to hot to cold and a polo is just a good in between and I honestly don't regret it and um, this one is not the best material so I'm honestly looking to replace it but besides that, yeah, it just gets the job done um, as, as of recently and I, I'm just happy with it and I just been wearing it like crazy. Once again, guys, that's pretty much it for today's video. I truly appreciate it. I want to thank everybody that's been with me throughout these past couple of weeks because I've noticed everyone's support. I've noticed everyone's comment. I try to get back to you as soon as possible, but I am a full-time student, like I've said in my other videos. And I actually got a lot of homework lately. I actually got a bunch of work. My grades aren't the best, and I'm basically trying to pass like every other student. And yeah, um, that's pretty much it. I've been uh, noticing a lot of engagement, which I do really appreciate it. Let's continue that. Um, once again, please like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. It does help me out and it helps me to continue on making these videos. And as planned for next video, once again, I don't really know, but I have been posting on TikTok, which is really strange because I don't see my content on TikTok, but I've been talking to a lot of people and they say like TikTok is the next wave, especially if you wanna just get into content creating, things like that. And yeah, I've been posting on TikTok. So if you guys wanna follow me on TikTok, it's gonna be down below, hopefully. And if not, just follow me on Instagram, which for sure will be down below below so you can see my TikToks. Um, as planned for next video, like I've said, I really don't know, but I know I kind of want to get into comparisons like cheap versus expensive, kind of make a little more reviews, kind of make this channel a whole lot more educational, but also throwing a little bit of my lifestyle, a little bit about myself throughout the videos. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Once again, thank you. And I truly appreciate it. And let's keep grinding and let's keep working.